Shalom everyone, Lieutenant Colonel Jonathan here. We are in central Israel in an IDF base. Behind me, what you can see is the IDF's COVID-19 lab. What we will show you in this movie is how we get samples from all over the IDF, how they're tested, and in a short matter of hours, we get results. Today, I have Dr. Noam with me. He is the head of this unit. Dr. Noam, thank you for joining us. Thank you, Jonathan. Now, could you please tell us, what is this place and what, what's the IDF doing here? Well, first of all, let me welcome you to the newly founded COVID-19 IDF lab. We are all together working in order to sample our soldiers and produce the results for the uh, corona tests. Well, how many tests have been done here so far? Uh, we've been working for almost three weeks. We've been receiving hundreds of samples a day, which sums up to a couple of thousands up to now. What you see right now is actually the process of delivering those samples into the lab. Okay, meet Liron and Dan. They are both dentists working in the forensic unit. Uh, now, occupying this very most important uh, part of the, of the samples processing, they are actually collecting the samples from the military police and preparing them in, uh, to enter the clean room. Inside the IDF's genomic lab, now this is the special lab that deals with the COVID-19 test results. Together with me is Ruven. You're an Israeli civilian working for the IDF and right. you're head of the IDF's genomic lab. Correct. Now please tell us what it is that the lab is doing, the actual details of the tests and the entire process that we saw started outside and what's being done here inside. After some research, I came up with the knowledge that we have all the basic equipment needed to do the test, and we only need to do, make uh, some adjustment to all, both our facility and our equipment. Okay, so it took about six hours in order to process samples. Of course, it can take a bit longer if you were dealing with a mass uh, number of samples, uh, because of the, of the uh, separate stages that uh, the sample need to go. Dr. Noam, to complete the process here, tell us about the final stages of what the lab does. So, as you said, Jonathan, this is almost the final stage of processing the samples. What you're, see, what you're seeing behind me is the real-time PCR. Those final results are immediately, using the same computer system as I told you before, are sent to the Ministry of Health and to the soldiers. As you can see, the results are being transferred from the machine directly to the system. Within a couple of minutes of getting the result, the soldiers will be already informed about the results of these tests. 